Welcome to Getaway Geese. We are Stu and Jane, and with Harry, our Ford Custom Auto Camper, we share our adventures. I'm not going to get into which number it is, don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> this is just another Q&A, because we have no idea how many we've done now. Uh, yeah, so welcome back to the channel, to this uh, sorry, one. Uh, to this one. Uh, if you've got any uh, com uh, questions you want to ask, put them in the comments. Um, we've categorised the questions that's, uh, that you've uh, asked us, and so we're going to pick them up. We're going to do a, a personal one, a trip one, and a YouTube one. Should we take the personal one first? Yep. Right, so who's this one? Steve Bell off YouTube. Hi, Steve. Hi, Steve. Uh, how did you guys meet? Oh, blimey, this is going to be a long one. <laughs> There's a story here. Okay. Shall I start and put well, the background? Well, no, don't make it too long. Okay. <laughs> so, so, I'll night. try to short. A short F version. First of all, both Jane and I have been married before. Okay, so first of all. So this is our both our second time brand and that. Um, so several years after our, our first relationship we got together so how we got together was was do you remember friends reunited is one of those first social media things that was out there it got sold i think was it to google or somebody like that and then it disappeared but i um got in touch through friends reunited after i, I was divorced um and uh, with uh, an old school colleague who said why don't we do a school reunion so I thought, why not? I wasn't doing anything. So we did a school reunion and uh, that person, unbeknown to me, um, was going out with Jane's brother at the time. And uh, so we were making the arrangements for that. She thought uh, to, uh, no, I didn't know this at the time, she thought that uh, Jane and I would be a good fit. Yeah, so she kept going on about this bloke and I'm like, yeah, I'm sure he's not that nice. <laughs> And she was right. <laughs> I was right. No, I'm joking. Um, yeah, she just thought we'd be really well matched and she was right. Thanks, so, Liz. <laughs> so they engineered a, a position where, first of all, we uh, Jane would happen to meet me in a pub, which I didn't know about because we were talking about the reunion, and engineered a fact for Jane I to come and to meet check me. you out first. <laughs> check me out first before she said yes. <laughs> So I, got, so I got through the preliminaries and then I went on to the next level uh, where I got invited to a meal uh, at James Brothers yeah. and we sort of then decided to very quickly get together after that. I'll be honest with you, it was a bit Within of a whirlwind about after that. three weeks? Yeah, we, we, we hooked up on my, my 40th birthday, uh, formally if you like. Um, and Within then 21 years. Yeah, yeah, we then moved in, believe it or not, we bought a house, so we got together in, in the months. April. We we bought a house in the November together, um, and then got married uh, several years after that. So we've uh, we've been together now for twenty one years. Twenty one years, and that's how we are. So yeah, it was a bit of a, a fate look. Yeah. So if it wasn't for um, all of those circumstances, yeah. we wouldn't have got together. So no. that was it. Uh, so that's the personal one out of the way. Let's do. You can breathe now. <laughs> Get, the... <laughs> Get the YouTube one. Right. Uh, Campervania. Hi, Sue. Um, whose idea was it in to begin your van adventures and vlogging? So, obviously, it was Stu's idea because he was the only one in them to begin with, but why did he do it? Well, this all came about from. for a few years I was thinking about you know about getting a van or it started off with getting a mobile home to start off with um, and, thank and God I managed we, to we, sort we, of we, we, we talked ourselves out we sort of been, gone into a few holidays where we'd, we'd moved around and started to enjoy traveling actually more than anything else didn't we? We did a road trip in a yeah. mini which was just hilarious yeah. wasn't it we did yeah, around Scotland oh my god we just had the best yeah. few weeks and, and I think that um, we basically did many stops on the way up, many stops on the way down. We never stopped anywhere, and we no. had such a blast, didn't we? And yeah. I think that's when it we started. In to... fact, you picked all the locations on the way back, and I so, did all the locations. Can on the I way just up. say <laughs> the way up was very organised and it was very nice, but the yeah, way back yeah. was a lot more fun <laughs> for all the wrong reasons. But it's the one we're still talking about today. Yeah. And it after was that, great. Yeah, it was yeah. really good fun. Yeah. And after that, we. Um... 
we were lucky enough to go on a cruise which did, did several countries and we just got the sort of traveling bug so i i then did start to get into all oh, camper van videos and watched loads of over over a couple of years and, and then we got this why don't we and jane went along well she went along with to start off with why don't we get a van when i retire which was going to be you know when i was 67 type of stuff um and one day you, we just thought you bought into it then eventually didn't you you got yeah into i did it. it was only seeing harry actually we'd seen a couple of vans that i just thought i can't, can't i do, can't do yeah. this yeah. and yet the minute i walked into harry i was just like it became doable this is for it. you didn't it yeah. yeah so yeah it was sort of my idea jane got on board with it and that and we went forward well, i think it's important that both of you enjoy it the same because oh, it must be hell for yeah. <laughs> if if one of you doesn't enjoy it as much as yeah, the other. I think if Jane hadn't got engaged with it, it would have been, you know, it would have been wrong to carry on with it, to be perfectly honest. Yeah, Stu yeah. always talked about a mobile home or a static caravan that we went to at weekends, which, you know, which is great for some people. For me, it's just my worst nightmare. So, yeah. um, so I managed to stall him for a few yeah. years, by which time his mind has started moved, going moved towards to a, to a van, yeah. Yeah, he's got just, you know, what do we want to do? Do something different in life, and I think there was a bit of that as well, wasn't there? And we both yeah. wanted to do it, so and we yeah. decided not to wait to retirement because we bought it early, which was we the best thing we did. We bought it four years early, uh, so yeah. if, you, if you're thinking of doing it, do it now if you can, yeah, because you, don't, you yeah. just don't know what's yeah, the just, just go for it, I would say, yeah. Mm. And we did, you know, so yeah. um, thank you for that question. So the next one is about a trip, so this is off Lorraine G. Hi, Lorraine, I know out in Ireland. Um, so, so you, uh did you expect the adventure to be as good in Ireland before you set off as you both have told us you really love it and will come back? So did you expect the adventure no. to be as good? No. No, we, I, I thought it was going to be good. I didn't think it was going to be as good or as great and memorable. I didn't have any preconceptions of it, and but I was just absolutely mm. blown away. And when we were going to go originally, this was during... Covid, mm. we were actually only going to go for two weeks because I was still working. There was no thought that I wasn't yeah. working at that point in time. So it all sort of came together in a way because I, I got made redundant and, and redundant as I said. And then uh, we decided, right, in that case, we can go. We can go for a long period of time. So it became, well, how long can we go for? And mm. we had no, and um, we did a five-week trip. We had no idea how long we could stay in no. Harry, which was part of the test. And in one um, in at one point we were on right move, weren't we? Looking at houses, looking if we could live over there, and it was yeah, just we like loved it's the not. Kilty area, didn't we? And yeah, that's, uh, it just wasn't viable for us. We've got a big family, got five kids, yeah, and it just wasn't. It wouldn't have worked for us, no. but we would live there if we could. You yeah, know? and I, I'll be yeah. interested to see when we get back from Europe if if I'm, you feel about the same we're saying about it about that, every place. Every oh, I could live there. I could live yeah, there. Yeah, I don't but, know. Uh, but I mean, no, just... it was it was def, def, Lorraine. It was definitely better. Yeah. It delivered so much more, and I can't, you know. And you we're know. well travelled, aren't yeah. we? Between the two, yeah, of us. Yeah. we've been yeah. a lot of places, yeah. and and it was just it yeah. was just fantastic. Yeah. And so we are planning to go back to do the north yeah um, so because we enjoyed it so much yeah so it blew us away yeah, yeah absolutely i hope that came across in the videos yeah. so thanks very much for those uh, questions uh say if you've got any more drop them in the comments and thank you very much and we'll see you next time